Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. In today's video we're going to be taking a look at these PBT keycaps by HK Gaming. In this kit we have 108 keys as well as 31 extra modifiers. So without further ado let's go ahead and unbox this and see what comes inside. At first glance this whole setup seems pretty decent. The box itself comes in a nice custom box which in my opinion compared to other keycaps in this budget price range is something you don't see very often. Inside the box comes two trays. Here's the first set. And here's the second set. And then we have our keycap puller, which is actually quite small for what we need. Let's go ahead and take a look at what's inside the trays. Overall, the keycaps actually look fairly impressive. I was expecting a lot less. The legends and the quality of the PPT is actually fairly decent. So what we're going to do now is swap out the keycaps from the KBD-8X Mark II and see how they compare to the GMK White on Black. While I have two different sets of keycaps on the board at the same time, I did want to do a quick comparison between the two. Now let's go ahead and switch the rest of the keys and see how those sound. Alright, as you can see, the colors of the keycaps are actually really good. Even though these are keycaps that are basically based off of a lot of the current GMK ABS double shot keycaps, they actually perform pretty well. The overall quality of the legends is actually really good as well. There isn't really any bad defective legends or crookedness to them. The spacebar itself has no warping and seems to have really good sturdiness to it. To be honest, I am actually really blown away at the way in which these keycaps perform in comparison to my GMK keycaps. So what we're going to do now is do a quick typing test. First, we're going to test out the white on black GMK set and then test out the PBT keycap set afterwards, just so you guys can get an audio and visual comparison of the two. Overall, I'm going to be completely honest here, there really isn't much difference in the sound quality in comparison to the GMK white on black. So far, these are the cheapest, good sounding, budget PBT caps that I've purchased at around $40. Honestly, the only issue that I've found so far with these keycaps is there are some small defects, possibly from the molds. There's also the possibility of them not being in the correct alignment, but that could also be my switches causing that. But overall, the kit sounds amazing. The colors look really good. The legends look perfect. There really isn't much to complain about for the price that you pay for these. This is by far the best budget keycap set that I've found so far in this price range. If you're looking for a keycap set that is going to sound good and look amazing, this is definitely a good one to pick up. 
Also, if you need a keycap set for filler, uh, if you're waiting for group buys or other keyboards while you are waiting, you can definitely pick up this kit and you will not be disappointed. Well, guys, that's it for the video today. Thank you so much for watching. As always, feel free to like and subscribe if you like the content and we'll get more videos out to you guys soon. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave it in the comments below. Stay awesome. Peace. Gosh, really? Damn, these things sounds good. <laughs>